Since the McGirt ruling came down, there has been lots of confusion. Well, the McGirt ruling has changed the way that uh, I think everybody has looked at jurisdiction. Many asking who is involved, who is affected, who owns what. For the time being, it's a lot of learning, but also preparing. The McGirt ruling was just about the Creek Nation of Oklahoma, but I think everybody automatically tried to apply that to all the five tribes, which do we believe it sets the precedence that it's going to impact the Choctaw Nation, Chickasaw Nation, and so on. Yes, we do. Chief Batten and tribal leadership have set up a committee to probe law enforcement, child welfare, and judicial affairs. $2 million has also been set aside to help guide future efforts when it comes to the McGirt ruling. The nation is hiring more police, social workers, prosecutors, and defenders. We want to assure everybody again that our task force is, is in place so that we can assure the consistency again and that people are legally going to be prosecuted in their proper jurisdiction. But there could be some triggers that make this a reality sooner rather than later. If there's a case within the Choctaw Nation, which there are, but they're up for um, for review. And if they get uh, approved where they do not have jurisdiction, the state does not, then that will make it go to either federal court or to us. That's the reason why we're trying to get ahead of the game so that we are prepared. That's